Ah, uh, the place you never visited. Hey, Will. Hey, Lou. Which place do you want to visit? And things you want to check off your bucket list. I never been to Japan. Actually, I would like to visit Japan. Uh, of course, gr grew up. Uh, sort of uh, looking at Japan from a distance, being into tech and gadgets, kind of one of the important origin spaces for that. Sony Trinitron, got the Walkman, Nintendo. There's like a whole connectivity there from a nostalgic perspective. And then just looking from a distance at the, the sort of technological metropolis, Akihabara district, never went. Uh, it's also amazing how there's like almost no crime there. Like, people just coexist somehow, even in tight quarters. I'm sure plenty of slimy elements. It's everywhere you go. Uh, of course, Will, you did a Japan trip, mm -hmm. and you loved it, right? Yeah, it was amazing. And the food? Oh, amazing. And the Great. food's amazing. And there's actually a lot of geography in Japan. If you travel around the country, small country, but you can go through some very different environments. Yeah, if a lot of them are traditional. Uh, some are, like, super modern. You know, so you get like a mix of both in like prefectures that are like right beside each other. You know? Right. So it's great. But also you can kind of like there is some wilderness and stuff as well, right? Like yeah, you can yeah, yeah. like there's Mount mountains. Fuji. Mount Fuji. Mount Fuji is there. Yeah. Uh, did you get to have any high-end sushi, something like this? Um, yeah, but I really love their like just everyday. Food, Every day. You know, it's great. Yeah, so I will probably pick Japan. Is there a place, Will, that you would like to visit you never visited? Antarctica. Whoa. Yeah. Kirk's been there. Why are we naming places that other people have been <laughs> around the I table? Know, it's just, I, I think uh, one of those expeditions on a ship would be amazing. Wow. You're going full wilderness. You're going to yeah. freeze it out. Yeah. 